Expo 2020 has just announced that it will launch a 5G service with Etislat at the event. We're here to find out what that means. You're watching Inside AB. I'm Jeremy Lawrence, and I'm joined here in the studio by Shay Shaquille. Shay, this is great news, but first for people who don't know, including myself really, what exactly is 5G? How does it work? Okay, so the most obvious benefits are, well, 5G is you know, the next step after yeah. 4G. Before that, it was 3G. Um, 5G will be 100 times faster than 4G. So wow. if you've ever seen a blank page on, while browsing something on your phone, which you know, we all have, yes. say goodbye, um, YouTube will never buffer. Um, because 5G is just that fast. Right. Um, so, and right now your phone does about three things, right? You can make voice calls, you send SMSs, and you use mobile broadband. 5G, it'll be only mobile broadband. Um, so everything you do will take place on mobile data from now on. Uh, well, from when 5G is bec becomes a reality. Um, so there's a lot of things that will happen. 5G actually might be one of the most obvious ways that we tell the world has changed in the next five years. And you'll be able to tell. It's hard to describe right now, but literally everything will happen on that network. Wow. So Expo is primarily aimed at businesses uh, connecting with each other up at that site. What's right. it going to mean for them? Well, you know how we were talking about, you know, the world will be completely different. Um, that Some of that will come from like consumer facing technologies. But the most, like for businesses, maybe it might be more apparent because for instance, like Siemens is creating this internet of things um, software or has yeah. it and it's bringing it to Dubai Mindsphere. Um, now when cranes have to talk to each other th through cardboard boxes with NFC chips or like, you know, when, when autonomous connected vehicles are figuring out how to navigate a city's mm. grid through road sensors um, in, in, on, in the ground, that's all probably gonna happen through 5G. I mean, we'll figure it out how it happens, but from washing machines, talking to smartphones to everything, that could happen all on the 5G network. The 5G network has a lot more capacity bandwidth um, and just no latency. So you won't really feel those lags that you do with 4G right now. Right, so the expo is all about innovation in business. This gives a platform for that. Yeah, I mean, everyone is right now talking about how is the world gonna change. Mm -hmm. You hear things like AI, automation, machine to machine, um, 5G. This will be the test bed. Mm. The expo will be the test bed for where companies try to see how it's going to work. The, now, the, the, the folks organizing the expo uh, haven't required it, but you know, the, Dubai understands that this is something that has to you know, draw people to the expo, to, and this is how it's going right. to happen. But my understanding is that 5G is not fully developed yet. Is that true? Yeah, it's, you're absolutely right. 5G is not developed yet. The standards will come out sometime in September. Etislot is working really hard to be the first operator in the world to bring it anywhere. Um, it's, you, it's doing that through this Chinese company called Huawei, uh, which is really far ahead of the game. So what they're doing is they'll use a, a prototype antenna. Once the standards come out, they can replace the antenna. Uh, but right now, at least they know what the technology is capable of before they figure out the standards on which it's supposed to be used, um, which is some really complicated telecom telecommunications uh, ideals of, you know, a lot of engineering involved right. in there. Uh, but before that, they can figure out, you know, how to work with autonomous vehicles, autonomous machinery, you know, yeah. uh, a lot of other things. Um, and, and, the, and the core point here is that they don't need to bring it, but to get the whole world to come to this event that Dubai has spent a lot of money on, uh, they need offered like best in class, next generation possibilities. For everything, really. Absolutely. Great. Okay, Shay, thanks for running us through that. Um, it's going to be a great event. We look forward to bringing you more details as we get them. So uh, you've been watching Inside AB. Please do join us every weekday at 10 a.m. Subscribe, comment, share. We'll see you next time. Bye.